In this video, I'm going to show you how to graft a tone stack onto a 5F1. So we're going to be putting a tone stack from a twin reverb onto this 5F1. <clears throat> um, now, the quality of this video may not very be very good, but the information is um, you can download these for free so you can look at it yourself. Um, go to Ted Weber. Uh, and he sells speakers, and he also sells guitar kits. And these uh, schematics are his version of the original, so they're clones, basically. Now here's, it's labeled 5F1, and then he also has the, uh, this is the twin reverb, and he calls it the 6A80. So <clears throat> let's go through the twin reverb schematic here, um, or it's a wiring diagram, sorry. Um, okay, so we have a bright switch, a volume, a treble, a middle, and a bass. Now on the 5F1, there's just a volume. And here's the tone stack right here. It's this little capacitor. So it's actually much easier than you think to graph this on. Let's, uh, let's follow uh, this tone stack. So it's coming off of the number one pin from the preamp tube. And this number one pin goes up here to this little junction point here. Uh, it goes to the left, there's this 100K resistor. And if you go straight up, there's this 0 0.022 UF uh, capacitor, which is the tone stack. And that goes straight to this potentiometer, the right leg on it. And then this uh, middle leg goes down, um, goes down here all the way here and we're going leads down to the number seven pin of the same preamp tube now the third leg just goes to ground all right now let's look at the more complex one let's start at the number seven pin which was on here this number seven pin went all the way up to the middle leg where does the seven pin go let's see goes up all the way to the middle leg on the volume. Now, the other one, pin one. Let's follow pin one, because this is gonna be much different. Pin one goes up on both of them. It goes to the junction point on both of them. If you go to the left, it goes to this 100K resistor. We're gonna leave that there. Now, if you go straight up, this on the 5F1 is a 0 0.022 UF capacitor, but over here, it's a point 250 picofarad capacitor and let's go back down to that junction point now if you go to the right here there's nothing on the 5f1 but on the twin reverb there's a 100k resistor and this 100k resistor goes up to this uh, 0 0.047 uf capacitor and a 0.1 uf capacitor and then so this was basically made like these two other wires so now as to where this, um, the 5F1 only has one wire coming up to this one pot, um, this made three extra junctions, so now there's three wires instead of one going up to all these pots right here. And basically that's what you graft on. So um, on the 5F1 you're basically cutting this wire off here and you're grafting everything else on the other one. I lost my place, where was I? Right over here. So yeah, you're cutting this off and you're grafting all of this on. You're grafting this uh, 250 picofarad cap, you're grafting this 100K resistor, and then from the 100K resistor, you're grafting both of these uh, capacitors on the 0 0.047 UF and the 0.1 UF capacitors, and they go up to these wires, and you just follow these wires up and copy that whole tone stack. So that's that's all you do. It's actually really simple. Now you can uh, get these schematics. It doesn't have to be from Ted Weber. Uh, they're all the same if they're a clone. And get both of the schematics, or the wiring diagram, sorry, and you can compare them. Um, so I hope this has helped you. So it'll be a fun mod. All right.